Calvin Nicholson. Welcome to Calvin's Guide Game. Hey, here at this channel we do board game reviews. I do what I played last month. Um, I do those videos just to give you a shot of, of what I'm playing and maybe you like playing those games too. Um, I also do board game reviews like I said where we tell you what we think about the game and how it plays. Uh, we don't go over all the rules but we go over a few of them just to get you the gist of how they play. But today's video is about I was traveling for business and I ran across a guy who had a bunch of games for sale so I decided to give them a try I never really heard of a lot of them but we're gonna do this in two separate videos because I uh, got quite a few board games so without further ado let's start them out the first game is called crisis hunter crisis hunter is by capacity the flux capacity group um, it's for two to four players ages 12 and up and it says it takes 15 to 30 minutes Never heard of this game. It's kind of a small game, as you can see. Of course, uh, it's just a... Man, it's maybe may a six inches long and about four inches wide. Very small game. Not sure what's in it. Uh, haven't taken it all apart, but hopefully we'll get a review on this game, let you know what it's like and what it, how it plays. Uh, but this is Crisis Hunters from the Flux Capacity for two to four players, ages 12 and up. 15 to 30 minutes. This may not be something I keep in my collection, but I'm going to give it a try and see what it's all about. Next up <clears throat> is Grimoire. Grimoire is, sorry about that folks, Grimoire is by Z-Man Games. It's uh, two to five players, takes about 30 minutes to play. Um, it says 12 and up, and I think this one was pretty intriguing to me. I've never heard of it either, but it talks about uh, grimoires are the ancient tomb, tomes for which wizards learn their spells, everything from the simplest of cantrips to spells of unspeakable power. Wizards generally use this knowledge to help their fellow adventurers to quest for fame and fortune, but sometimes they turn that power on each other. So I think this is wizards that may be fighting each other, casting spells on each other. So I'm kind of looking forward to this one, to try this one out. I'll let you know what I think about it. Uh, like I said, it's by Z-Man Games, two to five players, 30 minutes, 12 and up. <clears throat> the next one is a game, uh, it's called Game of Thrones. Uh, haven't ever watched the television show. I know that's probably going to shock a lot of people out there because it's very popular. It's an HBO series. Uh, this franchise is, is very popular. People really like it. Um, this is by Fantasy Flight. Uh, Fantasy Flight puts out some great games, so... This is a two-player game of Game of Thrones, and it's called Winter is Coming. Uh, it's the uh, House of Lannister and House of Stark cards. Don't know anything about either one of them, but it says it's 14-plus uh, to play, two players, 30 to 40 minutes. So I'm hoping this is going to be a pretty good game. I don't know. Never watched the show, so I'm not sure how the character is supposed to play out. But the characters look pretty cool on the back. Um, looks like there's uh, people from the movie. They just took scripts or, or uh, screenshots of people from the movie and, and put them in there. So I hope this is a good game for Fantasy Flight, Game of Thrones. The next one is Dark Minions. Never heard of this game either. Uh, it's also by Z-Man Games. Um, it's called Dark Minions, a fantasy dice game. Uh, hordes of Dark Minions have descended upon the countryside eager to secure their reputation as a, as a scourge of mankind so this is a 10 plus three to five players 40 to 60 minutes um, I kind of like games that stay around the third 25 to 60 minutes I do play some that take two to three hours but I really like the games that stay in that that kind of uh, time frame don't know much about this game I hope it's pretty good if not Hey guys, if you've played any of these games uh, that I've mentioned so far or that I'm going to mention, comment and let me know what you think about them and if they're any good. But Dark Minions, uh, it's 12, 10 plus, 3 to 5 players and 40 to 60 minutes by Z-Man Games. Alright, The Walking Dead. The Walking Dead um, franchise, you know, is another one that, that has been put out and put out. They got a bang the walking dead which i do own i played it a few times i've never played one of the board games uh the walking dead this one's called the walking dead prison uh it's by skybound games and top eight magic um 
It is for 13 plus, one to six players, and takes 60 to 75 minutes. So we're moving a little bit further into the, the time link that I'm not real uh, happy about. But uh, not sure about this game. I've only watched probably three episodes of uh, The Walking Dead, so not real sure about this one. But uh, The Walking Dead, The Prison. All right, Island Fortress is the next one by Fro Frost Forge Games. Um, Island Fortress, I believe it's about building a wall and you're using um, convicts and colonists to do this. So, not real sure. It's kind of a worker placement game. Not sure how much I'm going to like that. I'm a big fan of worker placements. You know, it's not one of my favorites. Uh, but this one is... Two to four players, 45 to 90 minutes, and recommended ages 13 plus. Um, Island Fortress is, like I said, by Frostforge Games. Not real sure how much I'm going to like this game. Don't know much uh, about uh, the uh, uh, wall building, but I think I might enjoy it. Who knows? Uh, this may not be one I keep in my collection either. But Island Fortress, powered by uh, or done by Frostforge Games, guys. That's the game so far that I bought. I'm going to do the next video and show you the rest of them. Guys, thanks for watching Calvin's Got Game. Please like, share, uh, subscribe, comment, and if uh, you, you, know, you have any questions, please let me know. Or any games you want to see reviewed, let me know. Uh, get a board game to the table, and thanks for watching Calvin's Got Game.